Since the pandemic, we've heard how our state's high school graduation rates have been really stagnant, yeah. even lower compared to other states. But there is one place in New Mexico where the graduation rates are actually significantly improving. That would be our prisons. Spencer Schott spoke to one inmate today who finally got his high school diploma while he was behind bars. And Spencer, this was a really big achievement for him. Yeah, that's right, Tessa. He and many others reached this milestone today. In fact, the New Mexico Corrections Department set a personal record for the number of inmates who got their GEDs while incarcerated. And the hope is that this will give those inmates something to keep them from ending up back behind bars. Tony Alejandro, you you know. Donning their caps and gowns over their orange jumpsuits, 10 more New Mexican inmates earned their high school degrees on Thursday. I'm really excited because uh, now I know that there's a lot of things that I can do to better myself. This is the first time in years that the New Mexico Corrections Department met their graduation goal set by the state's Legislative Finance Committee. Last year, there were only 82 inmates to get their GED, but this year, 198 prisoners graduated like Patrick Burgess, who says this opens more doors for him once he's a free man. I had had jobs before and stuff without my diploma, some pretty decent jobs, so I felt, oh, well, I don't need it, I can get a job. But I feel like now that I've got it, I, I can better myself in a lot more ways. Like going to college or learning a new trade. One, two, three. There you go. But in the meantime, these graduates got to celebrate with some ice cream. Now, Burgess says he felt so accomplished when he earned his degree. He is now a tutor helping other inmates who are studying for their GED. Good to see. Yeah. Spencer, thanks so much.